Hi guys, it's Laura. Thanks for watching and welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you an outfit diary. I have filmed for the entire week what I was wearing, so if that's something you're interested in, then please keep watching. Today I'm wearing this pale pink cotton shirt with a vintage lace sugar skull motif on the front part. I also replaced the sleeves, so now the shirt has lace sleeves. And I added the same lace on the bottom edge of the shirt so that it would be a little bit longer, which is something I enjoy a lot, especially when I'm wearing shirts like that with jeggings or with stretchy pants. I am pairing this shirt with my jeggings that I made myself and with these pink sneakers that also have sequins on the top. They are super cute. And over the shirt I'll put on this denim jacket and I will also wear a scarf, so I picked this cream colored scarf. I'm wearing these earrings that kind of look like lace. They are silver earrings and the little pearls are probably plastic, but they look a lot like moonstones, which is good because I'm pairing them with my moonstone necklace with a howling wolf that I love so much. And I'm also adding two of my Moonstones rings, of course, together with my engagement ring and with my wedding band, which I never take off. And I'm also wearing this full pearl band in my ponytail. Today, I have decided to wear this beige shirt and high waist jeans with a beige belt. This is my today's jewelry. I have decided to wear these dreamcatcher earrings with blue stones and I matched them with this cool dreamcatcher necklace. This is one of my favorite necklaces. I find it so pretty and so cool and I think it goes very well with denim. There are a few reasons why I really like this shirt. First of all, I love the color. It's this very pale beige, or you could call it cream white. It's a color that's so easily combined with any other colors. It goes pretty much with anything. I also like the texture of the fabric, that it has these rows. And last but not least, I absolutely love this lace-up detail in the front because that makes the shirt a little bit more interesting. Here we have my hairstyle. So today I'm wearing French braid. I always loved French braids. I have been wearing French braids since I was a kid and I just love the hairstyle because first of all it always looks put together. Second, you don't have to worry about your hair the entire day long because it always stays nice. And the next thing for me personally right now, since I'm dealing with the washed out purple that just does not want to go away, it's a great way how to create a nice transition between your natural hair color and the color that you're growing out because when it's braided, it looks kind of cool. It kind of melts into the natural hair color that I have on my roots and it just doesn't look so crappy like when I'm wearing my hair down because it's patchy right now and it just does not look good. I just have to wait it out. Over my shirt, I'm wearing this beige jacket. Uh, Jack bought this jacket for me, I think like 10 years ago. I had it so long, but it's still so pretty. And I'm wearing these off-white sneakers. I had these for, I think like eight years now. They still look good. So I'm very happy about that, that I don't have to replace them. Today I went with this full suede skirt that I made myself and this top with three quarter sleeves. It is pretty cold outside today and it's pouring so I'm also wearing a tank top underneath this top and I'm wearing warm stockings and because this material likes to stick to stockings I'm also wearing an underskirt and I paired the skirt with this vintage belt with this sun buckle. It's super cute. I drifted this belt not so long ago. My hair is again braided, again French braid, especially because I'm going to my ballet classes so I definitely need my hair off my face. And I picked today my silver hoop earrings with a few earbuds with a little stone. Hoop earrings are definitely my favorite type of earrings. They go with everything. I have these in silver and in rose gold and they are just so timeless. And on my neck uh, I'm wearing today again my 
Moonstone pendant with the Howling Wolf. And I'm again wearing, besides my wedding band and engagement ring, the Moonstone rings. And since it is damn cold, I'm also wearing a scarf and my full leather biker jackets that I made myself. And I'll pair this with these high boots because it's pouring and I don't want my feet to get wet. Today it's pretty chilly again, so I'm wearing this long sleeve shirt with a howling wolf on the front. This is a shirt from my spreadshirt shop. I embellished it with these rhinestones and I also extended the sleeves. I have a tutorial for that on my DIY channel, so just like the other things that I made myself, everything is linked down below. Uh, I'm wearing a tank top underneath this shirt which is basically the same dark gray and I paired this with my dark gray stretchy pants and I picked these dreamcatcher earrings with crystals. Today I have done something different with my hair. I'm wearing this side braid. I picked these boots today and I will wear this gray jacket with a hood. This is one of these materials that don't let wind in and that also are kind of water resistant. So it's perfect for the crappy weather that we're having outside because it looks as though it's gonna rain and I don't feel like dragging an umbrella with me today. So this jacket is perfect. Today I felt like wearing something sassy, so I decided to wear this tartan outfit. It's a two-piece outfit, it's a shirt and a skirt. I made it this way on purpose so that I could pair the skirt also with white shirts or black tops and so that I could pair the shirt with something else. I'm wearing a petticoat underneath the skirt so that it's even a little bit puffier and around my waist I'm wearing this thrifted uh, belt with the sunshine belt buckle. Right now I'm wearing this outfit with these black boots. It is still pretty cold and I also have to drive somewhere and when I drive I like wearing either boots or sneakers or any shoes where I kind of don't care so much. I don't want to destroy my nice ballerinas and pumps but later uh, I will put on simply black ballerinas and I'll be wearing my fall leather biker jacket with this outfit. And when it gets warmer in the afternoon, I will swap the fall leather jacket simply for this denim jacket. And here we have the ballerinas that I plan on wearing with this outfit. They are studded. I did that myself. And of course, I have a tutorial for that on my DIY channel, so I will link it down below. There we have my outfit number two for today. After work I grabbed my bike and we went together with Hercules uh, to the park. Uh, we had a nice walk and this is what I was wearing. So I had this black shirt with dark gray edging on the top and these leggings with mesh sections. I made these leggings myself so again tutorial is linked down below and I paired this with my neon orange running shoes. My today's outfit reminds me of Northern France, which I love so much. I've been once to Bretagne and it was so beautiful. And that was also the inspiration for this shirt that I made myself last year. So it's a cotton shirt. Yeah, it's kind of self-explanatory. I put also my signature crest on it and I will link the tutorial down below. I paired it with my jeggings that I also made myself and with my off-white sneakers. My hair is again braided. I have to wash it later, but I have some errands to run, so it will do for now. 
I'm wearing today again my favorite hoop earrings with a few earbuds and besides that I didn't pick any extra jewelry because the shirt has already nice details on the top so it doesn't need any embellishment there plus I'm gonna run my errands on my bike which means I don't want to wear any extra rings I just don't like that when I'm riding my bike it feels kind of weird when you have like many rings I don't know why well, actually, before I ran out of the door, I had to change because it got suddenly so warm. So I put on these denim shorts. These were jeans and I simply chopped them and then I folded the bottom up and I have sewn it in place. I had these for, I think, 13 years now. They are a little low waist, but the back is a little bit higher, super comfy. And I paired them with this blue shirt with the print of my signature crest. Shirts like that are available in my Spreadshirt shop, which is linked down below. And I'm wearing a sports bra underneath that. I am supposed to wear sports bras for in total six months after my breast explant surgery. It's gonna be soon two months, so a little bit over four more months and then I'll be done. Well, and I changed again because I'm about to mow the lawn and it is very, very hot. So I put on this red striped uh, bikini top. Funnily enough, this still fits me very nicely, even though that was a bikini I bought when I still had my implants. I really like the neckline. I definitely have to copy the pattern because this year I want to make myself a new bikini and I would like to have another one that looks like this. Sadly, the pants are already falling apart because I had this bikini so long. So instead of the matching bottom, I'm wearing these dark blue pants. These are my Poland shorts. They are made of fabric that kind of looks like denim. I use the same fabric for my jeggings. Really comfortable and I thought they would go very well with the red bikini top. Here we have my last outfit for the week. This is nothing spectacular. I'm wearing just a simple pale aqua blue tank top with dark blue denim shorts. These shorts used to be jeans, but I chopped them off and I think I had them for at least 12 years now. And the shirt is also super old, but it's just so comfy and I really like this color. And for today, I'm not planning anything special. Our son is gonna come for breakfast in about half an hour. We're just gonna hang out at home and later in the afternoon I will grab my bike and Hercules and I are going to go to the park so I will probably just put on a sports bra underneath this tank top and I'm not gonna change. Oh and I forgot to say that yeah today I'm wearing a ponytail and I picked these earrings, these Dreamcatcher earrings with the blue pearls because they go very well with this tank top. And that is it for today. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you guys so much and see you soon. Bye.